All right, people, let's get to the point. Halloween 3D. I don't think it exists anymore. As I said before, this was one of the most talked about Halloween films ever. And the, the crazy part about it is it doesn't even exist yet. Halloween 9 wasn't even discussed on this level. I checked Scout Taylor Compton's filmography along with a buddy of mine. His name is JBM from Mr. Creep Show and Villain News. I checked with him and we discovered that it's not even on Scout Taylor's filmography anymore. They removed it. Which means Either she's not in it anymore, or there no longer is a Halloween 3D. I prefer to go along with the latter. There is no Halloween anymore. Not 3D. Let's start with what we do know about Halloween 3D. It was a 2010-2011-2012 slash 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 2013 American Horror Movie. See all those times they delayed it? It was meant to follow Rob Zombie's continuity. It was supposed to star Scout Taylor Compton as Laurie Strode and Tyler Maine as Michael Myers. Other than that, they don't know who was supposed to be in it. It was going to be directed or either written by Todd Farmer. I don't really know, don't really care. He's the guy that did Jason X. There are a lot of different rumors as to what it was going to be about. Some say that it was going to be about Laurie being in a mental hospital and Michael Myers stalking and killing the doctors. Tom Atkins was allegedly given a role in this movie as a psychiatrist or some kind of doctor and there is also reports saying that he was gonna make advances make moves on Laurie Strode so along with Michael Myers trying to kill her she had to deal with a doctor that was trying to hit on her as if Michael Myers wasn't bad enough that's just great and Scout Taylor Compton really hasn't done anything significant since 2010. And she actually had the nerve to say, I'm not going to star in Halloween 3D unless the script is good. She made a, a, a Skype video and they uploaded it to YouTube. Well, I don't think you have to worry about that anymore because there is no Halloween 3D. It's gone. My feeling is that they're going to try to either follow the original series or do something completely different. Or they can start making Halloween movies based on the comic books. That's just an idea. It's completely up to them. Filming was supposed to start in November of 2009, and it was going to be released that summer, the following summer, 2010. Then they switched it to the fall of 2010. Then they switched it to the fall of 2011. Then they switched it to October 26, 2012. And then they switched it to 2013. And now it's non-existent. They don't know when they're going to bring it out. And if they do know, they're not telling us. So as of right now, Halloween 3D is like a missing person. Somebody that's been missing for several years. And what do you do with a missing person after you can't find them? You declare them legally dead. So as of right now... Put on your seatbelts and drive over to the coroner's office or whoever's office because as of right now, the Michael Myers fanatic is declaring this movie legally dead. It's dead. 
There is no more Halloween 3D. So please allow the Michael Myers fanatic to do the eulogy. And here it goes. We are here today to mourn the death of Halloween 3D. It was a piece of crap movie that starred a dumb actress who couldn't act if it depended on her life. It was supposed to follow Rob Zombie's piece of trash movie. So now, as we bury this piece of crap, I would like to say a few words. Rob Zombie, you can get hit by a bus. Don't you ever bring your ugly face to another American studio ever again. I think you should be deported from this country, even though you were born here, on the sole purpose and reason of being a complete retard. Scout Taylor Compton, nobody liked you anyway. I don't even know how you could bring yourself to be making demands on a movie when you just started acting yesterday. You're a piece of trash. Nobody liked that corny Rob Zombie Halloween 2007 except for John Ferreira and a few of his candy ass friends. May both of your careers rest in peace. And that concludes this video. Along with your careers, the Michael Myers fanatic is declaring this piece of crap to be legally dead. And whether you idiots like it or not, I approve this message.